This is part of the fast training. F A S T. Fight aerobics and strategy training. So this will be a guided meditation for when a fighter is cutting weight, whether it's extreme weight or just a little weight, doesn't matter. You must deprive yourself of many nutrients in order to reach such feet. And that you don't have to deprive yourself of actual nutrients, just what produces those nutrients within us, which is food, drinks, so forth and so on. So, with this in mind, let's go ahead and start a guided meditation to be able to preserve our sanity for one during the time because we're going to deplete ourselves of every nutrient, every mineral, every factor that fuels all our cells necessary, nerves and brain cells and all that. So, first of all, close your eyes. Take a deep breath in through your nose. Let it out your mouth very slowly, only after holding it for a few seconds. Hold it. Once you breath out and then breathe in naturally, slowly. But very deeply in through your nose and hold it. Three, two, one. Let it out very slowly. Hold it. Once you're done, breathe in naturally. Deeply into your nose once again until you can no further and hold that breath for a slight bit longer this time. If last time was nine seconds, this time let it be ten. If not 11, if not 12, if not more, and then take it out. Now, you continue that breathing at your own pace, at your own rhythm, at your own profoundness, with such deepness of inhalation and exhalation. But please, do not forget to hold on both done breathing out and after you're done breathing in and both times hold that breath for just a few seconds before technically letting it out take a deep breath once again when you're ready now I want you to picture a fine bright light just like the ones that turn on and go towards you once you win the fight and your hand is risen. Imagine those lights going down your spine and lighting up every crevice within it to unravel and expose all the innate abilities you have hidden within the CNS, Central Nervous System, which is located inside of your spine. Now, to your five senses, you will be able to master the four corners in the ring. Technically, it's only three of you. The referee being one of them, your opponent being the other, and you being two, number two, the second fighter, because the second fighter is the one that's going to end up standing at the end because the first shall be last and the last shall be first. If you're the last man standing, that means you're the first one having their hand raised in that match, naturally. So keep breathing even after you have reached this sense or notion of victory. Let your breath act 
access everything within one, which is you, within your universe, while you and I, V-E-R-S-E, universe. Just like in the Matrix, once you enter that dojo in with Neo, or technically you will be Neo. Neo has the same letters as one, 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 because you have already won, one, one, more than half the fight, one, 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 now that you are breathing properly, win, win, win forever from this point on, 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 if you keep your cardio at an optimal state, that doesn't mean you need to do a bunch of running in order to strengthen the cardio. In fact, right now, as it is, you are strengthening your cardio, so don't feel weak. Do not feel weak. What if there is a spy within your camp and they see your weakness? Don't let that happen. If you're not weak right now, they won't see any weakness. The report back to the other camp would be fear. Nothing but fear. So. Never let your weakness be shown. Always let your weakness out. Never bottle it, bottle it in, bottle it in, bottle it in. Let it out, let it out, let it out, let it out. Never bottle it in. Never hold. But definitely don't overcompensate or overshoot because you will be caught off guard by letting go too soon. So, only let that liquid, that fluid inside of you go for now, only, nothing else. Although you have not had any nutrients or anything to drink in such a long time, although it's been hours, it seems like days. But remember, you are already victorious just in this moment because you have dedicated this much up to this point, so don't feel low never let nothing get you down get your vibration up even though you feel low on energy never show your weakness never show your weakness use that weakness to your advantage we all have a small weakness if we don't acknowledge it it will conquer us and thus we are our own worst enemy so don't be your own worst enemy. You are number one. There is no two in the ring other than you and the referee. No more three in the ring. Thus, you conquer all four corners of the squared circle we know as the ring. And thus your five senses are now back to full optimal state even though you are fully drained at this moment. Why? Because you're about to reach yet another of your dreams. As you conquer with your five senses those four corners and you don't let those three judges Dictate that outcome of you two wonderful warriors, and thus one, you are now awakened with full energy because you are the one. You have won the battle. Stay awake, stay alert, stay alive. Breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out, just like a locomotive. You are one with everything. The ring is one with you. The referee is one with you. The judges are one with you. Their corner are not one with you because they will not know what makes you the one. And thus why the entire arena, all 18,000 of them are cheering for your grandeur now that 
you are the champion!